Hello, ladies and gentlemen. I am one of the authors of the paper, a taxi dispatch model based on combinational optimization. This paper contains consists of two parts. The first part is about how the taxi dispatch model works. From a common sense view, we may just want each passenger matches the nearest driver, but the reality is not so simple. Look at this picture. From request one's view, taxi one may be the best. But from our DD platform's view, we should take all the passengers and the taxi drivers into consideration. So the best solution may be dispatch request one to taxi two and request two to taxi one. To solve this problem, we built a model like this. First, we use logistics regression to estimate the acceptation probability between each taxi driver and each passenger. And then we use the probability matrix to formulate the expected successful rate of all the orders. By solving this model, we obtain the best dispatch result. The second part of this paper is about how to predict a passenger's destination before making his traveling. By analyzing a large number of users' traveling history, we have discovered several interesting patterns. This picture shows the histogram of a sample user's departure time corresponding to one of his destinations. The shape of the histogram is very similar to that of a Gaussian distribution. So we decided to use the Gaussian distribution to fit it. But how to compute the mean value of several departure time is an interesting question. One traditional method is as below. It transforms all the variables into vectors and compute the average of all the vectors and then transform the result back to the orig original representation. But this method has several problems. This case shows the problems of the method. To avoid these problems, we formulate a model like this. Uh, by solving it, we can obtain the desired mean value and the variance. Like the departure time, the departure longitude and latitude are also circular var variables. So we can use the same method above. And we use a three-dimensional Gaussian distribution to fit the three quantities joint distribution. At last, we use a Bayes method to estimate the probability of each of one user's destinations. That is what about this paper. If you want some more details, please send an email to us. Thank you.